Hey there, this is Lula LV. Thank you so much for joining me today and I hope you're having a great one. In this video, we're going to take a look at all of the new women's handbags being released at Louis Vuitton in October. We're actually going to start with a couple items that were released on September 30th, then look at all the October releases. There is so much good stuff coming this month. Then at the end, we'll take a sneak peek at what's coming out in November and December. I have to start off by mentioning the East West Pochette Matisse. I did a video on this bag a few weeks ago. If you missed that video, I will link to it above. But this was released on September 30th. When I did that video a few weeks ago, my client advisor told me it was supposed to be mid to late October, um, but it was released early. You can see here on the website, it is add to cart, and the price is confirmed at 2,910 US dollars. Here's the official photo from Louis Vuitton of the bag. And we also have a shot of the interior of the bag. I wasn't sure what the interior looked like when I released my previous video, but it is three compartments and the separator between the front two compartments has a zip closure. The back of the bag does also have a zip pocket Although I have heard from people who have purchased this bag that the back pocket is not large enough to fit an iPhone. So that's something you may want to keep in mind or double check if you're interested in this bag. I do also want to take a moment to talk about the straps on this bag. There is a canvas Neo Noe style strap as well as a chain strap. And of interest, there's two D-rings on each side with Vachetta trim around them. So you can attach both straps at the same time and they do each have their own separate D-ring. So I thought that was an interesting feature on this bag, but there are some other people who have purchased this bag and there's unboxing videos online. So I will find a few of those and link to them in the description box below. Also released on September 30th was the Rose and Cream Bicolor Empreint Collection. This is so gorgeous. Here are all of the items included in this collection, but I do want to note, I only see two of them on the Louis Vuitton website, the Pochette Matisse and the On The Go Tote. So I don't know if the other items will be released soon or if they're just not listed on the website, but if you're interested in any of those other pieces and you're in the US, you might not be able to order it online, but definitely call client services or check with your client advisor. Here are some photos of the Felici Pochette. And I also wanted to show this photo here that I got from the purse forum of the interior. It is a light beige color fabric lining, so just to keep that in mind. And here I'm just inserting some photos of the other pieces in this collection. We have the on the go tote in the MM size, the Pochette Matisse, the Bagatelle, and the Zippy Wallet. Moving on to October, the Ski Capsule will be released on October 14th. And for handbags, that includes two components. One is the Cozy Gram, which is the canvas with shearling. That is three pieces. There's also a much larger component, which is the giant monogram nylon. First, let's take a look at the Cozy Gram. That will include the Neo Noe BB with a shearling top handle and lining. It will also include the Diane in the PM size where the flap of the bag has shearling and it will also include the Locky BB again where the flap of the bag has shearling as well. The much larger component of this capsule is the pillow collection and that is the puffy nylon that has the LV monogram embroidered on it. So it's almost like quilting on this really fluffy 
a puffy nylon bag and you can see here there's a lot of pieces included in this collection I inserted some photos here of the pieces not every single piece in this collection but most of them there's silver which we just saw on the maxi bum bag black which you can see here on the on the go tote there's also navy as well as pink and all of the accents for this collection are in monogram canvas it's mostly the puffy nylon monogram as on the short handle here on the palm springs mini however there is canvas accents that you can see on the round coin purse as well as some of the straps are in canvas as well uh, for example as on the phone case with strap but if you like nylon there's a lot coming out in october also coming out in october one that i am personally very excited for and that is the carry all pm and mm in emprunt leather these are coming out on october 28th in two different sizes the smaller size the carry all pm is three thousand fifty dollars and the larger size the carry all mm is three thousand two hundred dollars this will be released in three different colors cream noir and turtle dove however all three colors will not be available in both sizes the only color available in the small and large version is black however cream which is the off-white color will only be available in the smaller pm size and turtle dove which is the beige color will only be available in the larger mm size one other important difference to note between the carryall in monogram canvas and this new version in emprunt leather is the closure this new version has a zipper closure whereas the original carryall in monogram canvas had a tie strap closure i'm not sure if anything else is different i have not seen any other up close photos of this bag other than what i'm showing you right now I also don't have a confirmation of the exact sizes. However, I would assume that the emprunt leather sizes are the same as in the monogram canvas, but we will be able to know that for sure closer to the release date. There will also be a new small leather good released on October 28th, and that is the Celeste wallet in monogram canvas. This comes in two different color options, teal as well as rose ballerine, and it will be priced at $595 US dollars. On one side, there is a tri-fold opening with card slots and a slip pocket for cash. The other side has a snap coin purse. Here we can see the version in pink, and again it's exactly the same as the other one just a different interior color this is a really nice new option for a compact wallet from louis vuitton and now let's move on to a few exotics as well as limited edition bags that caught my eye this is not a comprehensive list but these are a few that i thought were worth mentioning the first one that caught my eye again is coming out on october 28th a lot coming out at the end of this month it is a capucine mini which is the smallest version of this bag with over six thousand swarovski crystals i believe sewn onto the outside of the bag and this is absolutely stunning i saw a few live photos and videos of this bag on instagram they were posted by some louis vuitton client advisors and this is stunning it is expensive it's ten thousand four hundred dollars probably because of all the labor that's needed to attach the crystals to the outside of the bag uh, this also has it looks like matte black hardware as well this is absolutely stunning however if ten thousand dollars for a capucine is too much for you there's another version this was actually released at the end of september 
but I am obsessed with this. It is a metallic rose gold capucine. This was also released, which I'll show you in a little bit, in the twist as well as a capucine wallet. And this was featured in one of Louis Vuitton's recent capucine campaigns. So here you can see it modeled on the street in Paris. As they say here, it is a pearly pink Tyrrhenian leather. And not only is the leather a metallic rose gold, but the hardware is also rose gold. And Louis Vuitton does not do rose gold hardware. I think this might be the first piece with rose gold hardware. If anyone else knows of any other pieces with rose gold hardware, let me know. But I think this might be the first. This is absolutely stunning. It's $6,750, so it's a little more affordable than the Swarovski crystal ones. Capucines do typically run around five to $7,000, so this is on par with the other capucines that are available from Louis Vuitton. Here's all of the details on the bag if anyone's interested, um, but this is currently available. The rose gold leather with rose gold hardware is also available in the twist style. And this again, I think just looks so stunning. I absolutely love this. It comes with a braided chain top handle as well as a removable shoulder and crossbody strap. Here we have a close up of the rose gold hardware and it is just absolutely stunning. I am so obsessed with this colorway. It is also available in the Capucine XS wallet. Again, pearly rose gold leather matched with rose gold hardware. This is gorgeous. This is priced at $910. However, I do want to note I was unable to find this anywhere on the US website. I was able to find it on the EU website, so I don't know if maybe this is a Europe exclusive or if in the US you just have to contact your client advisor, but I have seen this out there. It's also in the same colorway, so I just wanted to throw it in this video in case anyone is interested. And before we go, here is one more close up of the hardware. I just think this is absolutely stunning. Also, I want to mention if you are into exotics, there is one piece in mink fur that caught my eye. It is the Noe Pochette Milla. And this is expensive. It's priced at $4,800, which again, it's pricey for a small pouch, but in mink, it might be a nice entry point if you are interested in exotics. And before we go, I do want to quickly mention the um, Christmas animation is also coming out October 28th. I'm not going to talk about it in this video because I did a whole nother video series on the Christmas animation collection. If you haven't watched it yet, I will link to it above as well as in the description box below so you can check out those videos as well. That's everything I have for October. Now let's look ahead at November and December. I'm not going to provide any item details on these products, but I did want to mention them. This is what I saw coming up for November as posted on the purse forum. The first item to note is the side trunk. This we saw in the cruise collection. Cruise collection will be coming out in November. Here it is in monogram canvas as well as a denim jacquard that's also coming out in November. Marquita LV Luxury just did a fantastic video on what's coming out in cruise in November. I will link to it above as well as in the description box below. So she mentioned, for example, the side trunk that we just saw is coming out in canvas, but not in reverse monogram. I think she even gave some prices. So that was fantastic. 
As I said, we will be seeing the denim jacquard as well as some new capucines and coussins. And another item to note coming out in November is the LV book clutch or walk as we just saw it called on the previous list. This again is coming out from Cruise. I've seen it in monogram as well as reverse monogram. So when I get more information on Cruise, I can certainly do a video. But in the meantime, check out the video by Marquita LV Luxury. She mentioned a lot that's coming up. And finally, the last item I want to mention is a new Capucine BB coming out in um, December. This is stunning. This is absolutely gorgeous. I feel like this will probably be priced around what we saw the Swarovski Crystal Capucine priced at. It was over $10,000. This has absolutely gorgeous gold, silver, and bronze beading, and it is set on a navy blue leather. This, I think, is just such a special piece. And that's everything that caught my eye for October, as well as a really quick sneak peek at November and December. And before I go, here are all of the charts again with all the item IDs, prices, release dates that I showed earlier in the video. So feel free to screenshot them, capture any of the information that you want to take to your client advisor. And with that, that's everything I have for today. Thank you so much for joining me. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Also hit that subscribe button and I'll see you in my next video.